Haven't you heard of uh, First Nolly TV? Home of Nollywood movies. Mm -hmm. Subscribe now. First Nolly TV. Don't talk that. Sister, do you even know what you're saying? So you, you want to sacrifice your wedding for an election? You are not even sure you will win. What has come over you? That question should be directed to any nurse father. Why bring politics into my wedding? Why would he attach conditions to marrying his son? Why? The people chose me to represent them at the na National Assembly. No, no, no. Where did you say the joy? When I was announced as a candidate, senatorial candidate, to represent them. Did you see the joy out there? Now you want me to step down and delete the video. How would they feel? How? My dear sister. <gasps> Are you sure you know what you're doing? You want to jeopardize your wedding and your happiness with saying here just to piss people on the streets. Are you okay? That's what leaders do. Mm. so predictable <laughs> I knew he was going to call you to back I knew it and that's the sign of a weakling same energy he employed in calling you if he did with a girlfriend and asked her to step down it wouldn't be where we are but He's always behaving like his Matana people. Shame on him. Jagaban, I know how you love politics. But I also know that you are wise enough not to allow your love for politics ruin the happiness of your only son. If the young lady refuses to step down, you as an elder should let this go. You are an experienced politician. You can easily... You are well connected too. You can easily win her by joining another political party and becoming their candidate. No way. Most times you sound very stupid. Shagaban? I live. You join another political party because of a non-entity, a non-starter, political tongue code. Sounds stupid. Things have changed. The dynamics of politics. I'm a strategist. The youths are in charge. You get them, you get social media, you get market women, we're good to go. It's just because I'm not used to, I'm not close to these Gen Zs. I wouldn't be pleading with anybody. And that's why, because of uh, her closeness to these people. That's why I considered that she could be a wife to my son. And I decided I'll make her my campaign manager. And that will help us to coast home good and fresh. But then, just got back on my medicals from Europe. And then, I'm told she is now the candidate of the party. Is a no for me. Damn. And you think, at my level, I should watch a small girl contest with me in politics? And then, until finally, that wedding will not hold unless she steps down for me. That's it. Jagaba. What has come over you? Do you know how mommy will feel if she gets to know that the wedding is not going to hold? Simply because you want to wrestle political power with your fiancé's father and winning Mandela. 
I am not wrestling power with anybody. I'm only obeying the people that want me to represent them at the National Assembly. You know, you really need to watch the way you speak to me. I am still your elder sister. Watch it. Mind the way you speak to me. Do I make myself clear? I'd like to have a moment with my woman, please. I need both of you to excuse me. Why, why, why are you doing this to us? What is the meaning of this? Huh? Why are you pushing away our beautiful moment? I know how long you have waited for this. How long we have waited, planned for this. Now the day is here and you're pushing it all away. What, 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 what's going on? One of the price to pay as a leader. Putting the people's pain ahead of you. I'm sorry, my love. I can't step down. What? Did you did you just say that? No, no. Did you did you just say that to me? Wait, what? What is this? No, no. What's 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 going on? What is the meaning of this? Are you really aware of what's going on? The market women. Contributed money to buy my senatorial ticket. Millions of Naira. Poor market women. The youths are also contributing for the election. And you want me to step down? First to show you how bad they need a messiah to deliver them from this old politicians. And you want me, Winifred, to step down? To disappoint them? No, my love, that, that's not possible. I can't do that. You can't spare me that bullshit, Winnie. What has come over you? When, 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 when did you start sublining me? What, 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 now I don't matter to you? Is that what you're telling me? You look at me in the face and tell me you care more about these people rather than me. Is that what you're saying? No, you, you don't care about how I feel. Come on, I care about you. I also care about the people. Are you aware that people are dying every day because they cannot afford just 1,000 naira to buy drugs? Then schools, about 10,000 people dropped out because they cannot pay school fees. I want to fix all that. I want to fix a lot of things for my people. I want to do more for my people. They need it. They need me. That's what I'm saying here. You think my father wouldn't do the same? No, he wouldn't be able to meet up with his obligations if he becomes the senator. Is that what you're saying? What is this, honey? What is this? Inyana, have you forgotten that your father was once a local government chairman? The records are there. Tell me, what have I ever done to you? No, Father, tell me, what did I ever do to you that you have chosen today or for all day to pay me back? What is all this? Are you trying to ruin my wedding? Why? Try not to step down on the wedding will go on. Oh, God. Father, listen. See, I, I have friends who came in from far and near. Now they've been calling me, asking me why am I not in church yet? Where is my bride? They're asking questions. What am I supposed to tell them? Eh? Tell them the wedding we no longer hold. Oh, Jesus Christ. Father, listen, I would do no such thing. I'm, I'm not about to become a single man on my wedding day. Why are you doing this to me? No, no, tell me. Why are you doing this to me? Look, look. People came in from different countries. They flew in from different places just to 
to honor my wedding. And now you're here telling me to tell them the wedding will not hold. Why? Because of your selfish political reasons. And what is all this? I will do no such thing. I will not. This wedding will go on. I will not do it. Naya. If you think you've grown to the extent of disobeying my orders and saying the wedding will hold in the name of God the Father, God the Son and God the Holy Spirit I will turn that venue into a morning field Oh God! Oh God! Did you, did, you, did, you, did you hear your brother? No, no! Oh God! Did you hear your brother? Did, so, so you, you tried to kill me, huh? You, you tried to kill me, kill my guest and probably kill my wife, isn't it? Did you did you hear him? Because of your selfish political interests. Now I see why Winnie will not stand up for you. You 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 are wicked man, father. You you are wicked man. Can, can, can you see your brother? Can you hear what he's saying? <laughs> Today of all day, this is what you do to me. <laughs> No, sir. Please, sir, I just want us to settle this and make it. Can you call him to let me know you have decided to step down? Phoenix, you do not have to call off the wedding because of our political differences. We are in a democratic dispensation where your son can actually contest against you or a choice of an election. It has happened in Quara before. Uh, listen, my dear. This is 042. Ain't no good to be precise and not what I stood. Sarah Key contested against the father on the choice of election. Please. I am not Sarah Key's father. I am Jagaban of the universe. And I have my own rules. You've already started showing signs of stubbornness and troublesomeness as a daughter-in-law. And I ask you, do you love my son? If you love and respect him, then you'll step down for me and concentrate on your wedding plans. Please, sir. I'm begging you, do not cut off this wedding, please. Please. Can you imagine a little girl? Giving me a lecture about politics and democracy. That's laughable. I will never contest an office. But a supposed daughter-in-law. No. Never. That's impossible. That's impossible. If you want to rule, you must kiss the ring of the master. No matter who you be, I don't care if you're chosen by the people who He will do anything to make you follow Until you kiss the ring of oh. I be make I give you the number oh. Give them the number oh. Be make I clear you the tape oh. Show them the tape I be make I show you the film oh. Show them the film oh. Zeta Gaban is the king oh. So this is it, Winnie You, you want to throw everything away Every, everything that we've shared, how, our dreams of becoming man and wife, all the time we have worked together and planned this, you, you want to trade away because of your people. I don't matter. No, I, I don't count. You don't care about me. That's what it is, isn't it? I mean, I'm not sure in everything we've shared away. 
Not. I love you. I truly love you. But I'm not the one delaying this wedding. Listen, I'm not even saying you should go against your father and marry me by force. That's not what I am saying. What I'm saying is talk to him. I am not his enemy. I am not stopping him from contesting. I am not. So he shouldn't be against my own ambition. Let us go to the pool and let the people vote their choice. That's all I'm saying. Uh, listen, Ayine. I am here for you. Whenever you are ready, you come take me to the altar. I'll be with her. Do you understand that all of this is at the detriment of our happiness? Congratulations, Nelson Mandela of our time. Or should I call you? Fumilayol Ramson Kuti. Zingam Bande. Yes! That's the women who gave out their lives for their people. You want to be counted among them, right? Yes! Freedom fighter. Lover of the people. Winnie. You ruin your wedding. You ruin your wedding, Winnie. Who could have done that on their wedding day? Mama is packing her things as I'm talking to you now. Vowing to leave this house first thing tomorrow morning. Mama is what? Who will she stay with in the village? Who is she going back to the village? <laughs> At least she can stay with people who can listen to her. People that will respect her voice. Winnie. After all the pleading, Mama pleaded with you to step down for your near's father. But you blatantly refused to step down. How do you expect her to stay here, Winnie? I'm leaving with Mama first thing tomorrow morning. You can as well enjoy your mansion and your world, since that's the only thing you listen to now. Rubbish. Fight until the end. I will not fear. I will not be intimidated by anyone. Not today. No. Not today, my father. You can try to break my heart. My. Or you cannot break my spirit. No. No. Not today. Not to me. Stop it! Give me back my drink. Listen, I don't want to have any conversation with nobody. Give me please. Give me back. Let me mourn my joy. I was killed today. And in there, nobody died. Oh, yes. My dreams of becoming a husband. Let me mourn my dream and my joy that was slaughtered by two of ambitious people. Let me mourn. You know nothing about how I'm feeling right now. Let me mourn. Mm -hmm. Engineer, please. Please stop crying. <sighs> Engineer, I, I need you to get hold of yourself. <laughs> <laughs> 
I mean, even if this wedding does not hold today, I, I promise you, I, I am promising you, we are going to fix this and you go back to the love of your life. <laughs> did you hear that? Did you, did you hear the argument? I want you to tell me the truth. Does, does it sound like those two people are ready to settle out their differences? Does it, does it sound like that to you? No. Did you, did you hear them? Did you hear what they're fighting over? Did you hear the argument? Look at me. Look at me. Huh? I'm, I'm back to being a single man on my wedding day. What a shit. What a shit. What a shit. Oh, in, in there, I understand how you feel. I mean, you are human. Please. <laughs> in there, you're my only brother. Please put yourself together. I, I, I beg you. In there, please. <laughs> Nothing good comes so easy. To be a great leader comes with greater sacrifice. I know this is not going to be an easy journey. But it's a journey I must undertake to save my people. I wish my mother and my sister would see reasons with me. This is not just my fight alone, but it's the fight for the people. Marriage. I know I desire marriage, but there is more to life than getting married and bearing children. Winifred Alexandra, you are born for a purpose, and that purpose you must fulfill. Standing up for your people. Be with me on this journey to the cemeterial seat of our zone. It is my destiny. It is my turn. Stifle all voices of opposition. Let the party chairman do my bidding. Let the party chairman do my bidding. And I promise you, when I win this election, I will come here and offer more sacrifice. Thank you, Grandmaster.
are you calling me? Uh, what do you want? You're calling to know if I'm dead or alive. Are you calling me? You, you cannot die. I I just got to, to, to know how you're doing because I know how you'll be feeling right now. You have no idea what I'm going through because of you stop on this. You have no idea. All because of your stubbornness, you you're supposed to be laying right beside me tonight as my wife. You're supposed to be here. We are supposed to call though. And then and, and have one of the most wonderful, the most beautiful time of our life, of our lives. We're supposed to be in each other's arms tonight. We, we already arranged for, for a trip to the Caribbean for our honeymoon. And you know that. You know. But you, you messed it all up. You messed it all up. Why are you calling me? No, why are you calling me? Tell me why are you calling me. B. If I wanted to be selfish, I wouldn't have chosen my people at the detriment of my happiness. I would have been beside you as your wife, locking loose with you, packing my things for for for, for our honeymoon. I just called you to apologize to you because I took a selfless decision today. And I'm sorry about it. I'm so sorry. It's fucking. Home of Nollywood movies. Subscribe now. Press Nolly TV. Don't touch that.